10 Things About Depression That You Need To Know Depression is one of the most life-threatening mental illnesses an individual can have. Depression is the home to many diseases and self-destructive measures. A person who goes through depression will experience such things that would encourage them to take their own lives at some time in their life. You might have a friend or family member of yours who might be going through depression. It drains out the positive energy from that individual and makes them bitter. Have you ever dealt with such kind of feelings in your own life? Have you ever intentionally thought or even tried killing yourself? If yes, then there is an undeniable point that you're struggling with depression. We have collected 10 facts about depression that you might not know. These will help you identify the sensitivity of depression and seek professional help for yourself or for your loved ones. Number one, depression doesn't always have a good reason. Many people have this misconception that depression always happens because of a specific tragic event in a person's life. These can be all manner of things like someone's business closing, someone dying, or someone losing their job or meet a significant financial loss. But the truth is, it is not mandatory to have a tragic or sudden event in life that would cause you depression. Instead, a lot of the ordinary people with their everyday life can become a patient of depression. Depression is such an extreme mental condition that puts a full stop in a person's life. It does not let anyone live happily or peacefully. To be able to get well from this illness, it is mandatory to consult professional help. Number two, women are more likely to be depressed. About 70% of women are more likely to become depressed than men. Women are naturally born vulnerable, temperamental, and careful. As women are more inclined towards building the core foundation of a home and taking everyone together on the same page, life gets too much and exhausts them. Also, because of their vulnerable mindset, they are more likely to be affected by someone's word or actions in general. People put more judgment and expectations on women than men because of their responsible and loving nature. You might hear once in your lifetime about some stupid comments like, she's so demanding, or why does she require so much attention from people? Also, why can't she manage her job and her family together? These are some of the cruelties of life that women face and cause them to go into depression. Number three, depression is more than ordinary sadness. Some people consider depression as an ordinary sadness or mood swing. Have you ever heard comments like, it is just a temporary phase and you'll get over it? Or, there is nothing such as depression, you're just having a rough time of your life. These kinds of comments reflect the unawareness and seriousness of depression that some people fail to understand. They put out such inconsiderable words because they have never experienced depression before. A person who has gone through this severe illness knows the extent to which it makes a person helpless and searching for peacefulness. Depression is not just sadness of your mood, but it is a total illness towards the destruction of your mind and body. It changes appetite, sex drive, weight, and sleeping patterns. It also troubles a person with indecisiveness, concentration, and memory loss. Number four, children can also get depression. Many people have this idea of a myth that there is no such thing as children's psychology or children's depression. This myth is entirely wrong. Children are also not immune to depression. Instead, there is a whole field of children's psychology dealing with such kids who get depression at such a young age. Generally, children are more vulnerable, energetic, temperamental, caring, and loving towards others. They require constant love and affection to be able to live a healthy life. Children affected by depression are mostly those who have a tragic family life or have faced emotional or physical abuse. These little souls become so profoundly impacted by these events or tragedies that they get themselves into depression. More than any other being, it is crucial to recognize the signs of depression in your child and seek professional help. Number five, depression is treatable. Some people think that depression is incurable or it is a curse that can't be removed. This perception of depression is entirely wrong and unethical. Like many other diseases in the human body, depression is also a mental illness connected to our brains and bodies. 
There are many great professional doctors or therapists who are there to help you out with this illness. There are different stages and symptoms of depression in other people. The doctor may recommend a cure according to the extent of your condition. Some options available for curing depression are therapy, which includes behavioral therapy, cognitive behavioral therapy, problem-solving therapy, etc. According to your medical condition, some other cures are medications, lifestyle changes like stress management, exercising, and a diet change. Number 6. Family History and Genes Matter with Depression Depression is a mental disorder that can cause complications of genes and family history affected with this illness. Depression has a way of coming back. It just does not happen once in a lifetime, or it doesn't have a specific period. Instead, it has an immeasurable time of repeatedly returning if a person is not emotionally healthy. Family and genes matter a lot. Some people inherit them from their parents or relatives. Suppose your great-grandmother used to be a patient of depression. Chances are you can also get affected by it as it runs in your family. Number 7. Severe depression can lead to physical changes in the brain. Although depression is supposed to be a mental disorder, it affects a human being's entire body. The severe kind of condition of depression often affects the human brain. Some of these symptoms can be shown in sleep-related issues, fatigue, speech patterns, and pain in different body areas. In a survey for detecting mood problems in people, half reported chronic pain. It affects the brain's physical aspects by reducing white matter that connects neurons and transports information. It also reflected a shortage of the hippocampus, an area of the brain which deals with memory and learning. Number 8. There is a strong link between alcohol and depression. If you're one of those adults who pass their leisure time hitting the club or having a drink by yourself, you should be aware of its strong connection with depression. Alcohol is one of the dominating factors when causing depression because of its strong influence on the human body. It is a saying that too much of anything is a curse. Just like that, there should be a considerable amount of consumption of alcohol if you're addicted to it. If you dare to stop drinking, it can be a life-changing benefit for you. Alcohol damages the human brain just as much as it impacts the human body, like causing lung or heart diseases. Number 9. There are different causes of depression. Depression is a mental disorder that can be caused by several problems other than mood swings or loss. Depression can be caused due to pregnancy, weather changes, menopause, trauma, chronic stress, and thyroid issues. The weather changes can sometimes negatively affect the human being's mental capability by disrupting the body's circadian rhythm. The adaptability of depression depends entirely upon a person's nature, personality, and willpower. A lot of people become depressed because they start to give up on their life. And finally, number 10, depression is not a choice. Several people are unaware of the seriousness and sensitivity of depression. In a lot of people, it is considered taboo to get depression. They have a negative perception of getting depression and consider it a curse on a human's body. The truth is, depression is never a choice. A person does not get depression to get a free pass of a lifetime to gain sympathy and apologetic behavior. Instead, depression forcefully enters a person's mental capability and reduces their inner peace. I'm sure you've heard a lot about depression in celebrities. This shows the extent of depression and that it can affect anyone. So, the only solution to manage depression is to consult professional help and work on yourself to reduce your chances of getting it.